Welcome to your 14-day trial of Paxata self-service data preparation. Begin by logging in with a Chrome or Firefox web browser using the URL provided to you in your welcome email. The first screen you will see is the project's dashboard page, which lists all projects you have created or which have been shared with you based on your user permissions. Because this is a fresh new tenant created just for you, you will see a starter project for learning the basics and may see additional project samples based on your interests and specific use case needs. These samples serve as a reference which you can learn from and adapt for your own use cases. The in-app help panel can be accessed from the help menu in the header bar. Help content is dynamically shown based on where you hover in the interface. For now, we'll hide it so we can dedicate more of our screen real estate for the data, but you can bring it back any time as needed. The help menu also provides quick links to information on recently added features. The Getting Started Help article, which gives an overview of the basic elements and concepts of Paxata, the Documentation Help Shelf, and a shortcut to email your feedback to us. The navigation menu to the main areas in Paxata is accessed at the top left corner. Note that your menu options may be limited based on your assigned user roles and permissions. Now let's dive in and get started by opening your tutorial project. A project simply represents the series of data preparation steps applied to one or more data sets, and Paxata provides you a spreadsheet-like interface to explore and profile the data as you perform the steps, to clean, shape, and combine it to make it ready for business intelligence and analytics tools, predictive modeling, and downstream destinations, including databases, data lakes, and business applications. We will begin by navigating to the data set that will serve as the base for our project. Here in the data library, we have access to the repository of all data sets uploaded to this Paxata tenant. We will delve further into the data library and how to import new data in the next tutorial. Click on the green Select button to load the contacts data set. Note that Paxata is designed to load the full data set by default. Be sure to hit Save to commit this first step. We're now ready to explore and prep the entire data set visually and interactively, while Paxata automatically tracks every action every step of the way. Throughout this tutorial series, your objective is to generate an output data set, which we call an answer set, to support a time-sensitive analysis needed by the marketing team. They want to understand the top industries and accounts related to certain customer segments based on new data, the year-to-date contacts in this case. You plan to present your findings on a dashboard using your favorite business intelligence tool. In the next tutorial, you will use Paxata's point-and-click capabilities to quickly find patterns, gaps, anomalies, and other data quality issues, as well as assess data consistency and completeness of your data.